Well, good morning. It's uh, Saturday, the 3rd of August. Another beautiful California day in the Sierra Nevadas. Uh, camped overnight, uh, sort of at a, just off the trail, uh, leading to the uh, uh, Kearsarge Pass where most people have to go in and resupply. Went out this morning and uh, was packing up and uh, I suddenly realized that there were tents all over the place near where I was camping. I thought where I had camped was kind of sketchy, not, not perfect. And uh, I had fire and away the best tent site in the area because I had pitched my tent at like 10.30 yesterday uh, morning uh, and left my, left my tent and sleeping bag and a lot of my gear there as I just uh, took a very light pack uh, down over Kearsarge Pass down into Onion Valley and then back again. Oh, so here's the plan for today. Uh, they have a they have a saying here among PCT through hikers that uh, you do a pass a day. Uh, and for the time of year, uh, say a month or two ago, uh, where most uh, PCT hikers through hikers are going through this section, that's appropriate because uh, they want to stage uh, themselves. So they go over each pass and the snow on each pass early in the morning when it's, when it's uh, still icy and firm. Uh, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna try to do two passes today. And I don't think the snow is going to be too much of a problem, but, but we'll see. Anyway, uh, something's happening here. And uh, we'll see how it all works out. Probably going to have to do a little bit more than 20 miles today. Well, Mr. Pika, you looking for a handout? You are so cute, aren't you? Do you know you're cute? Hippity hoppity hippity. Living in amongst the mountains. <sighs> Just came upon this tarn, hiking up crystal turquoise water. I don't know if it's coming through, but yeah, you can see the rocks buried underneath uh, the surface there. Wow. So this is heading up to Glen Pass. Oh, there's a trail right there. Uh, not really sure where it goes. I don't think I have to go up too much further. What a great looking tarn. Wow. I don't know if you can see the ripples there. These are trout. Oh, yep, yeah, there's one. They're trout rising. I can actually see them through this water. This, this water is so shallow. I'm amazed that trout are able to survive the winter here. Because this, I guess it's not completely frozen all the way down, but it's, this is not a deep, deep lake. Fabulously clear water. Wow. Wow.
this is Ray Lakes. Just crazy, crazy views. Everywhere, everywhere. They call this the Ray Lakes because there's a whole chain of them. You can see the next one. Sort of. Uh, I don't think that's connected. The chain of them down there. That I'm going to be experiencing. Wow. I, just jaw dropping beauty everywhere. I mean, just. Come back into focus. There we go. It's only 11 o'clock, but I'll uh, stop for a second lunch here because this is just too, too good. Too good. Uh, this is the uh, drainage from uh, Arrowhead Lake. <sighs> And this water is just crystal clear. And I've got a little stream crossing here. Gonna have to take off the shoes and put on the Crocs. This this trail. So this is north of Ray Lakes here. I mean, every turn is just jaw-dropping. Uh, if you can see in the distance that uh, cascade coming down from the snow fields up there. The trail goes right down in the valley. I know. Somewhere, somewhere down in here. Yeah. Man, I guess it takes a right-hand turn probably up in front of that mountain. We'll see how far I get here. A little after two o'clock. Over the next pass is gonna be at least a 3,000 foot climb. So, man, I am enjoying this though. Wow. <laughs> refried beans, dehydrated refried beans that I reconstituted. A little tapatio sauce in it. And some Cheetos. I think this is gonna be fabulous. One person at a time on the bridge. And now I see why. One person. <laughs> wow. This is crazy. I better put the camera away. I'm gonna drop it. Whoa. Another milestone, 800 miles on the Pacific Crest Trail. Stillwoods Creek. This this whole creek has been like this. <laughs> wow. And even further up Woods Creek. I mean it's all waterfalls and cascades. I bet you this one doesn't even have a name. Maybe it's Feral Falls, who knows? <laughs> And another view of Feral Falls. Let's see what's upstream. <laughs> 